Hello everybody, it's a Jusil here. Even though I'm not home uh, reading manga chapter 1044 of One Piece, I could not miss this despite the fact that I'm on holiday, despite the fact that this is no proper setup and of course technical issues abound. I have no charger for my laptop so I have to rush this. Not really rush it, it should stay alive for as long as I need it to but goodness me of course I had to lose it now for this chapter for which thank goodness thank the people who kept telling me avoid 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 I have no spoilers whatsoever I just have some friends telling me that they can't wait to see my reaction to it say nothing else I know this is gonna be a big chapter because of what happened in the last chapter <laughs> Luffy died didn't he Joy Boy has returned, hasn't he? But what does that mean? The theories in the past two weeks have been amazing. I've, I've been watching and reading stuff and making up my own theories. I've talked about it with a couple of people, but just it's all gonna be bullshit, I'm sure. But I cannot wait to see exactly what is happening with this. Kaido defeated Luffy, killed Luffy, apparently. His voice is no longer to be heard. And Zoro looks like He's also dead. Yamato said to Momo, let's go die together because we have to liberate Wano and or die trying. There is no point in just giving up. And then Tunisha came out and said, Joy Boy has returned. I can hear him. And the blob <laughs> coming out of Luffy's head, Luffy's hat, whatever. Well, let me jump into the chapter because I really want to see. I am so sorry if you can't see me properly. I hope you can hear me fine because of also the microphone is different and... Well, it is what it is, but I really want to read it anyway, so here I am, let's go. Chapter 1044, and the title is, let me go, on the page, it's Warrior of Liberation. <laughs> okay, okay, well, okay, well, that thumbnail is a little bit, I don't know, spoilery, but not really, because it looks like Luffy's fine, because there's... Nami and Tama crying. So, warrior of liberation. <laughs> okay, let's go. Uh, German 66, uh, an emotional excursion. Volume 8, Mama's away on her trip. Begin the experiments. <laughs> okay. Well, I don't... I don't... I don't have time. Who is this, this kid with the, with the knife? Anyway, um, some of the, the Charlotte kids experimenting on Niji and Yonji. Oh, well, <laughs> sucks to be them. Let's move on. I do not I do not want to stay there because what happened to me? Why can I still stand even though I lost? Is this Luffy? So we see we see a shot of uh, the back of Zunisha like looking onto Wano and this voice say what happened to me? And I think it's the Don Don is like a heart. Uh, Don Oh, is it the drums? The drums that they were saying, the drums of liberation? Why can I still stand even though I lost? I'm having fun for some reason. <laughs> I think it's Luffy laughing, no? And then the mom is also a little bit shook. Luffy is Joy Boy? <laughs> oh my god. Is that what Zunisha is saying? This is Yamato just going, huh? Because Yamato, of course, has also heard of Joy Boy. Oh, when we move away. Oh my god, okay. Pleasure Hall, left brain tower. Oh, Sanji. They, oh, they can all, they can all hear him? Ah, so, so Sanji gets up. You're you're awake, sir, pirate. Luffy? He hears... Everybody hears him. So performance floor. This is Kid and, and Law and Hyogoro. Huh? Is that, is that you, Straw Hat fellow? Straw Hat? Wait, he's still breathing. Luffy's alive. <laughs> this is Nami and Tabaji. Luffy's alive. Big Brother's still breathing. But so everybody can hear him, even though they couldn't hear the voice of all things. They can hear him now? Okay. So, boop, boop, boop. We're going to Marjoa. Okay, the Hall of Power, Pangea Castle. So we've lost an elite agent. Oh yeah, because Kaido wasn't too keen on what the guy did, even though he won. He didn't want to win like that. So, R.A.P. guy. We've lost an elite agent and made Kaido angry. What was the point? What if I told you that there was a potential future that would make us beg for this outcome? It is always better to eliminate dangerous variables. In every era, the world government has attempted to recover the... It's really the Gungan fruit. Oh shit, well, that's my theory out the window. What in the hell? Really? Let me move on. Let me move on, I'll think about what is happening later. Oh shit. 
in every era, the world government has attempted to recover the gum gum fruit, and not once has it ever succeeded, for 800 years. It is as though the devil fruit is trying to escape our grasp, and it very well might be. Zoan fruits contain a will of their own, and this particular fruit has the name of a god. The other name of the gum gum fruit is the Zoan type human human fruit. Oh, never, never, never would I have thought. The Nika Nika fruit, or anyway, Nika is the name of the fruit. The Zoan type human human fruit, mythical type model Nika. What the hell though? And the <laughs> laughter, possessing a body with the properties of rubber and fighting in whatever way he fancies, bringing smiles to the face of the people. The warrior of liberation, also known as Nika the Sun God, awakening brings his rubbery body greater physical strength and freedom. I did not. I mean, I'm sure. I'm sure the worst theory is about the fruit being a, a god fruit. So it's a human, but not because it's a mythical creature, a mythical a, a god. Oh, I would not. I would not have thought this was it, because. Because it's so strange to rename the Gungam fruit now, come on, I mean, anyway, anyway, let's move on, my god, this is what it is, no, and that is Nika, ah. <laughs> that is, it's Luffy jumping, I mean, it, it's, it's not quite him, we, we can see that he's a bit different, is the hat the same, like, the, Luffy's jumping from, um, um, one of the, the rocks to another, on Wano, I think that's Wano, we're seeing him go, the sun god, it is said that in all the world, there is no power more ridiculous! <laughs> you know what? You know what? Yes, it is ridiculous, and that is Luffy. So, even though that's not what I would have thought, I can believe this. But so, but why didn't they do anything before? Oh my god, anyway. Anyway, let's, let's keep reading. Let's keep reading, and then I'll think about what I think about this. <laughs> Treasure repository, second floor, Odigashima. Yori, I, I I loved Odin too. You know, oh this beach, oh this beach. Don't you even, Yori, please, Yori, please, please bring me peace. The, I loved Odin too. You know, think carefully now. I, I was being used by Kaido. Come, let's escape this wrath together. Now undo the nails. Uh, this is Orochi, of course. And Yori, still playing after you have kicked dirt upon every samurai to whom you owe the debt. Who do you expect will listen to you now? My father upheld his promise to you, did he not? He trusted in the deal that he made with you and Kaido to liberate Wano. For five long years, my father danced and made a fool of himself, never once explaining himself to his own family. My father kept this word. <laughs> and Orochi is like, mm, oh shit, oh shit. He believed that you would free the people in the end and withstood one hour of your boiling cauldron. He withstood the searing burns of the bubbling oil. Despite the smile that never left his face, he bore your torments all alone because the entire country was taken hostage. His suffering was unimaginable. I don't know she's listening. But she's not gonna give a shit, is he? What's the matter? Oh, she's, oh, she's seething with rage. She's crying probably under the mask. Oh my god, oh my god. Okay, what's the matter, Hiyori? Doesn't it feel bad when everybody says mean things about you, father? Mean Hiyori in a flashback. Not at all, my dear. Why not? Because... I have all of you! Really? Then we'll be together! <laughs> then we'll be together forever! <laughs> Actually, I re- This- I realize now that Odin was a great samurai! This is the beach talking, Orochi. In fact, speaking as Shogun, I think your father deserves- mm. Oh, look at that! Look at her face! Look at her face! Yes! Yes! The tears of rage! Oh baby, oh baby, destroy him! Destroy him, please! And the mask falls, and she's looking- She's looking fierce and she's just crying snot, but so mad. Look at the look at the veins. Look at the veins. My name is Kazuki Hiyori. Hold your tongue, you knave. <laughs> yeah. Okay, and he screams. No matter the growling of my empty stomach and the rags I've had to wear, I never shaved my father's name. You were never the shogun, not even for a single day. And she gets closer. Wicked, foolish, and wretched. The worse you became, the greater the insults to the lives that were lost. Uh, oh, not so fast, he says. Don't do anything rash now. Revenge is antiquated. It's behind the times, and killing me won't make it any easier to be Kaido. Although, 
it will make me really happy, sir. So, mm, uh, oh, Lord Orochi, I have failed. The, the blob, the blob, uh, Kazembo, yeah? Because so, he had left, like, I, I wasn't sure if he had been absorbed by the, uh, the beam that I think, um, so it was kids being, uh, kids and law coming down with big mom inside and, and Kazembo just sort, sort of got some of it, but then he's still here, the little remnant of it. Um, Lord Orochi, I have failed. Is that Kanjuro? I'm spent. No, perfect timing. I give you a new play to perform. But look at this bitch. Look at this bitch still trying. Oh, please. Please. Iori, Iori, I beg of you. Let me see what's happening. Burn that woman to death. Leap onto her clothing. <laughs> we'll call it the failure of the woman's 20 year revenge. Alas, what a tragic tale. Witness the plight of Iori, remnant of the Kazuki name. This is the fate of all who were once mighty. And he's still like, blah, 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 okay. Lord Orochi. Oh, oh, he's a, he just touched him. Okay, that's good. I don't know why, but he did that. So he attaches itself to Orochi instead and burns him. Yeah, okay. But not, not over here. Ah! And then here he goes, the dawn is sure to come. <sighs> Kanjuro, you idiot, help me. Iori, ah! And he's just, okay, he just keeps burning in the Kazuki clan. Always keeps its promises. I mean, that is the, is, is that the moon still or the sun? Because when we saw Luffy jump, it, it, it has to still be the moon because it's still night. That's still the, the festival ongoing. So that's the, the full moon, but completely key, clear. Okay. And we're awaiting the dawn though. And the, the drums are going, <laughs> but so, but so he's burning him, but, but not on Chiori's behest. I don't know how that happened. I'm not sure if I'm satisfied with that. <laughs> like. And finally, yeah, burn. But I wanted to, he ordered to just give him the final blow. Anyway, he's just watching him burn, like, burn, bitch, burn. Okay. And then drums. Ooh, I can do everything I wanted to do. I think I can fight a bit longer. My heartbeat sounds so funny. Does he, what is that? Does he have more limbs? So he he is definitely more rubbery. He's got like, like spaghetti hands and, and uh, arms and legs. This is the pinnacle of what I can do. This is gear five? Oh, oh, so, so uh, awakening also brings gear five? Or is it just that now he can do it because he awakened the fruit? Is it, is it even still, like, it, it sounds a bit like it's still Luffy, like the way he's talking, or unless he's being taken over by, by, I don't know, the, the spirit of Nika and, and it's, they're similar in that too, but I guess it's still Luffy. Because I thought maybe um, the awakening could have only come if he died. And then something, this something that now we know is Nika would take over. But it still sounds a lot like Luffy, even though he's very slinky. <laughs> okay, well, let's see. So gear five. Let's go. And that's that's Orochi. People screaming. Huh? Oh, oh, that's a, that's a lot of hockey. That's a lot of hockey coming from, okay, coming from above. Uh huh? And you see the, the the crackles. What is it, man? What is up there on the roof? <laughs> up you go! Up you go and take a look, bitch. Oh, she oh! okay, okay. The the, the the part of the ceiling uh, around the hole is crumbling. Hey, what's wrong? Is that Supreme King Hockey? Where's he coming from? Everybody's just fainting, and then a giant a giant fist comes down and grabs. Kaido, that's even... Ha has Luffy's um, King Kong gun ever been that big? Because he's grabbing Kaido. Kaido is big. That looks bigger to me. So, it, it, and it, it would, it makes sense. So, giant fist, come here, bitch, grabs Kaido. What is that Luffy? That's Chopper just crying. Oh, look, look at the... Okay, the, the, wow. And he's just grinning, of course. Oh my goodness. Ah, and he... <laughs> eyes <laughs> it's like like Brooke Kaido's eyes like what <laughs> because he gets yanked back up uh, um, Kaido and, oh my god is that is that him oh let me see him up close we're gonna see him up close before the chapter is finished right come on and he just yanks him up oh my god wow so ee, oh he's big <laughs> yeah oh well is that so that that must be flame colored or yellow 
he's got like f swirly flamey hair and eyebrows and the the thing that looked like a like a shawl uh that was white when he was in year four maybe that's still white but the rest is flames oh my god it looks so silly though he's just twirling kind of like this well, yeah it's so stupid look at the eyes <laughs> oh that said like the quote the googly eye quote we're just gonna reach it with this chapter we <laughs> quota yeah and he's just twirling oh my goodness wow okay and so he grabs him again and bam, bam. <laughs> he's just he's like one of those squeaky chicken toys he's just bam 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 all around <laughs> And then he just smashes him on the ground and laughs like an idiot. <laughs> he's, he's also, he's even got the little stars. Oh my gosh, it's a Looney Tunes cartoon. So hot. You survived. Thank you. Blast bread, of course. Off we go again. <laughs> he just really wanted to fight. So let's go again. And he can, just keeps laughing. He just... So, of course, we are playing on the ridiculous, the ridiculousness of this fruit, because he's just being an idiot. What is that? The, the eyes again? This is Luffy, though, seeing the, the blast coming, he's like, ah! and, Oh, oh, what the? Did he turn the ground into rubber? I think that's what he did. So, he grabs the ground and yanks it up so it, it blocks Kaido's beam. So now whatever he touches can turn into rubber too, not just himself. Oh well, man. Well, well, okay. It is it is such a ridiculous power. <laughs> Why would it be anyway? And then, and then he just grabs the ground again. Go! And he bounces it back. <laughs> that is so stupid. <laughs> so, so he uses the ground as a shield and then <laughs> bounces back the beam to Kaido's face. That is so cute. I would I would never have expected it. I mean, gear five, gear five. So he he was he was bouncy and big just because he was using specific attacks. But that's not how he stays. The gear five is just that fact that he looks more like Nika. He's got the flamey hair, but he's himself. Like he looks like himself. Still, his body is is normal. But he's got the flamey hair and the, the eyebrows look so silly. They think he looks so silly. And he's just laughing like an idiot. <laughs> That's gear five. I'm sorry about that idiot earlier. I didn't want to win that way. Oh, says Kaido. Don't sweat it. Let's finish this up. Oh my God, the eyes too. That is so strange. That is so strange. Oh my goodness, to be continued. Gear five. The human, human fruit model Nika Sun God. Oh my gosh. So of course, I mean, for some reason, the um, the name of the people who owned the gum gum fruit was Joy Boy because they brought joy thanks to this fruit, the power of the fruit. But so, so, but the last time it's been awakened was 800 years with the uh, before with the previous Joy Boy, which we, we don't know who it was, but we don't care. I don't know if we care. But so what, the, what does the hat have to do with all of this? It's just a coincidence that, I mean, coincidence. It's gonna be like, probably um, not so much fate, but the fact that he had it reminded everybody that the previous old Joy Boy, who was probably a giant, had it because of the giant hat in Marijoa. But it doesn't actually mean much, but still, no, oh my God. Wow, okay. <laughs> That is so cute. I really want to see the colors. I obviously, I I would not have expected this. I'm sure. I'm sure many people theorized this that like the the fruit was gonna be um, a god god model or something like that with different names. Maybe I don't know. Uh, not everybody said Nika specifically, but then it would have been a connection to Nika somehow. But uh, okay, Luffy. Okay. Oh my goodness. But it's so it's so weird though to think that. The gum gum fruit is not real. Like, I guess it's still fine to to call it the gum gum fruit because um, the properties of rubber are still it's still true. It's just got more than what we thought before. But it's not completely wrong to call it gum gum fruit because it would have been so strange to me. Like, just after more than a thousand chapters, the most famous fruit, we're just gonna call it something different. No, like, it makes sense to have both. But 
again, I really want to see the colors of Luffy in Gear 5. Oh, wow. Okay, this was a lot. <laughs> but that, it's, he looks adorable. He looks adorable. And that's, and of course, he's ridiculous. Like, I don't know if people were expecting something completely badass and like, but Katakuri is badass. King is badass. Um, I don't know. M Marco? Marco is badass, I guess. Luffy is Luffy. So this suits him so much. <laughs> I think. I don't know, but that's just my my opinion. It's a... Uh, of course, he has to be an idiot to bring joy to everybody. Bless him. Okay, well, I'm gonna try and upload this. I really, really hope. Well, if you see this, I managed, but my laptop might die before I finish. Please, no. <laughs> but wow, okay, this was great. This was great, and I'm so glad I didn't know anything. My theory is out the window, but not that I care. All of my theories so far has been wrong. have been wrong, so I'm happy to be wrong again. But wow, okay. Thank you for watching the reaction. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next week. Bye-bye.